Although September 8 marked a day of mourning with the first anniversary of the late Queen's death, the day also coincided with the celebration of King Charles' first official full year as monarch. Like many people across the globe, royal expert Christine Ross has praised the King for how he has handled the new challenge that bestowed him one year ago today. Ms Ross pointed out one thing that stands out as having been one focus areas of the King's first year of his reign. She said, the King's first year of his reign has been all about connecting with the people. He hasn't done anything particularly flashy or exciting, but has spent a lot of time meeting with his new subjects and promoting his long-term causes. Prince Harry already out of the country as latest UK visit lasts just 23 hours speaking to Express. Co.uk about how the royals typically take to their roles, she added, the British royals are not the type to launch grandiose plans from the start, but rather play the long game. Likening the monarch to his late mother, Ms Ross added, We saw Queen Elizabeth play a 70-year-long game, and her calm and consistent presence led to a hugely successful reign. While King Charles won't celebrate 70 anniversaries of his accession, he is certainly making long-term plans for his reign to ensure the success and continuation of the monarchy. Although his role changed dramatically this time last year, Ms Ross added that the king still remains true to his things close to his heart. Meghan Markle feels rejected by Brits and does not want to live in UK again she said, the causes closest to King Charles's heart, organic farming and climate change, among others, are perfectly suited to connect with today's changing and modernized world. His continuation of the coarse and slow, steady style of rule will create a consistency that will reserve him a page in history books. The King and Queen Camilla have remained at Balmoral for the somber anniversary, taking the day to reflect on their own personal memories of the late Queen. The couple have been staying at the Scotland-based estate for the last few weeks, having carried on Elizabeth II's long-standing tradition of enjoying summer there. Don't miss! Meghan and Harry are openly loving but another royal couple avoids PDA, claims, claim, King Charles so sad Harry won't meet him on anniversary of Queen's death. Details, Harry and Will still at war and didn't reunite on eve of Queen's anniversary, live, despite Prince Harry returning to Europe for work commitments, he failed to meet his father and elder brother amid ongoing tensions. According to one expert, the King will likely have been so sad to not have spent time with his younger son on such an emotional day. Speaking on Friday's Lorraine, royal expert Jenny Bond described the king as a man who feels things very deeply. She said, he cares about people, about unity, harmony, community and family, which is one reason I think that underneath everything, he will be so sad that Harry is in the country and is not going to see him as far as we know. you